Hi, I'm Neil of Team Teacher, teaching, living, and raising a family in China. Today, we are going to look at bike sharing rentals in China and how you use them. Let's check it out. Bike sharing became hugely popular when we came here and uh, it's kind of exploded into basically a bike apocalypse uh, as people have coined it. As you can see, there's just bikes laid around everywhere. Uh, now, we actually use bike sharing. Uh, we use one called Mobike. The reason we use that is because the app's all in English and it's pretty easy to use. Uh, all you have to do to sign up is you need, you can use your WeChat account to sign up, uh, connect your bank account here in China, and you need to send a picture of your passport as well. But it all explains it because it's all in English, so you don't have to worry. So let's have a look at the app. So the app's all in English, like I said, and it's pretty easy to use. You've got a little GPS button uh, that tells you where you are exactly with your phone GPS. And then if you just use your fingers to part away, you can zoom in onto your map and you can start to see where your closest bike is. Uh, there's bikes everywhere, but say for example, I didn't, uh, there was only one bike um, you know, kind of nearby and I know I was going to go on a trip soon, what I can do is I can actually tap onto that and reserve that for like an R one RMB for like 30 minute reserve. It's pretty decent. But let me show you how you use it. So one, you've got to click on the unlock and you bring up a, a scanning um, like function that you use your camera with. And let's go and scan one of these bikes here. So there's a little QR code at the back there's also one at the front and it's really simple you just scan it and the lock here just opens just like that okay so I'm gonna take a little ride so after you finish riding it's actually gonna give you a reminder of how to close the the lock what you do come closer there's uh, a little lever here. You just move that down and you can see the lock going straight through. And it makes that beeping noise. That means you're all locked and you're ready to just go about your day still. And the payment is gonna take it out directly from your account. So you don't have to worry about doing that. And you get certain rewards and stuff for your journeys. And you can actually look at your trip details, it'll tell you how much it cost, the distance that you went, uh, etc. And you can share this on your WeChat moments if you want to do that as well and let people know uh, where you are and stuff. Okay, well, I hope you like this bike sharing video. Uh, please uh, remember to subscribe and like our channel. Bye bye.